Hello everyone, it's Arthur Duck 2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on one bar. A mod that simply changes your health, hunger, and probably certain others to fit into one bar space. And obviously pushes your XP to the side of the uh, hot bar. So, uh, what it does is, what I just said, as well as... Uh, let's see... And for such and such, you can push it in different directions. Um, when it said the positive and negative effects, I thought it meant something like potions and such, which maybe is the case. Check the feature roadmap as well. Um, oh, okay, so it's how it pushes things in that to different sides. So when it's health, it's the red bar. Health boost. Okay, and then, yeah, okay, so it is related to potions there. Um, and then otherwise there's display other information, like for if you're on a pig or horse or something like that, if you're wearing armor, uh, and so on. So yeah, there's also a feature roadmap of other stuff they're going to add in the future. So hardcore indicator, mixed effects, and a bunch of other things. Smart armor, horse armor, boss bars, and a few other things. So yeah, powdered snow effect and whatnot. So let's take a look here. So we've got uh, 14 there. I assume it's supposed to be full health, I'm pretty sure, something like that. Just take damage, you can see 12. Let's do that again. Let's do it a bunch of times and we'll just see what happens actually. And how it drops. You just do a slash kill, of course, but yeah. So 20 there, okay, so that was my full health there. Um, I don't remember if I have a... I may have a... I was gonna say, it's like, I don't have a no hunger bar sort of thing, do I? Don't remember. Um, let's see, we'll go... and apply something like the hunger effect and see if it displays anything there. I'm just curious. So we can see how long it'll take on the actual bar, so you don't have to constantly keep going to there or look to there to see with some other mod that displays it, which I'll get to that one in a different video. Oh, XP bars to the side, because I've probably got the uh, um, indicator there, but if I change that, I assume it would be normal. So off, that's there. Put it across here, it's there. If we move it with the hot bar one. It moves out of the way, which I was actually wondering if it would overlay it or not, but it seems they did consider that. Um, what else can we do? We can do... Obviously I've got no hunger right now, so it's just the actual uh, effect that's there. Go under water and check with the breath bar. Where does that fit in? So I'm assuming that's under the A part, so that A0, A1, two, and so on. It's part of that. Yeah, so that part's there, alright, so we can tell that's our health, and then that's our breath bar that was sort of fitting in at some points. So if we just go back to here, so you can see how the breath bar's going down, and so on. We can also test with poison and the wither effects, or bunch of effects overlaying as well, so just do poison, and we'll do... We'll just do the weather effect as well, just for like a few seconds, just so we can see in there how a bunch of overlaid are. Like that, so we just go... What else is there? Dorpens Grace or a bunch of stuff. Oh, can you just go away, thanks. Great. Um, glowing effect, what else have we got here, um, absorption, a few seconds, mostly you just seeing them stuff up there, so some stuff doesn't overlay maybe, health boost I think does, because it's obviously expanding your hearts there, so, glowing is working, yep. So, you can see in the how health boost will do absorption, I don't think does much. Really, actually, we'll find out once it disappears. Yeah. 
Oh, okay, so that was the plus four. Yep. And health boost is there. And then that will disappear, and then eventually we'll get out hearts again. Yep. Um, other than that, what resistance, apparently. So let's go to that, see how that does. Resistance, let's go like seconds or something. So that displays the percentage. Doesn't display the timer, but it displays how much you're getting. So I assume like you get an extra 20 or something. Um, and that is level 1 too, so... That's also that. Um, I'm just gonna go with... A of enchanting just to see how the XP bar works. So we can see... Yeah, so it is just a small bar, but it's just a, like a an indicator. So, well, like the attack indicator there. Just displaying and then filling up as you go. Um, I think that's it though. Yeah, because we did potion effects, water, uh, survival under water with the breath bar. Um, health and a few effects. Uh, could do horses, technically, as well, or mounts. Uh, yeah, I can't remember if pigs technically also display that information. I think they do. Um, let's try, just in case, like a saddle. I think you just put a saddle on a pig, don't you? Yeah, and then it displays the information. Okay, so you got ten there. Same with the horse, we'll do the same thing. And we'll also have to display armor, I just forgot about that. So you can see it's 53 health. I'm also wondering how it's jump bar displays. We'll check that out as well. Come on. Oh, come on. There we go. So horse armor for one. What does that display? Nothing. Saddle. That's also that. Now the jump bar. Does not seem to display at all, so that's unfortunate. Which would usually be part of the XP bar, but it is not in the case of that. And then we'll put some actual armor on, so let's go, say, iron, for example. So it's just those little... That, that line there above your health, for some reason, okay. Interesting. I thought it was like little parts, but it was just a continuous line. Um, other than that, smash mods you could use alongside the little benefit. Uh, the experimental stuff like counters and zero saturation. Um, but other than that, yeah, you could pretty much just want to have um, some information displayed in a particular way compared to how it typically is. Then uh, you can have things across an entire bar, your XP pushed to the side, and uh, as long as you understand what most of the numbers are, you're pretty much good to go. Just have everything in less space and in consistently one bar space. Thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.